So we're here today with Tony, one of the Songcroft apprentices from 2010. She's a first year apprentice and we're just kind of winging this. So uh, she's in the middle of lunch and I'm like, ah, oh, can I do an interview? So, uh, you know, bear with us. Um, I don't really have a set, set of questions, a pre-thought out set of questions. So we're just going to play it by ear. So Tony, what's it been like being an apprentice here at Songcroft this year? Uh, very informative. There's a lot of um, information I didn't know. Um, Marilyn and Brian are both very, very informative. They have a lot of information. They answer all the questions very um, in detail so that you can really understand what's going on and, and how to solve any issues that you have. Great. And what inspired you to um, be part of Songcroft's uh, self-sufficiency skills course? Um, well, I like the um, lifestyle. I like knowing that I could live independently if I wanted to and, um, and, and just live off the land. The whole idea of it was really inspiring to me. And um, if, or oh, I know, what uh, was your highlight of the year so far? We have one more class left in Barter Fair, but... Well, I like the class today, even though I'm taking a lunch when my my schedule, my eating schedule is off. Today. What's the topic? <laughs> is uh, oh solar, and um, yeah, it's, it's how to use the solar power, uh -huh. and the different ways you can do it. The other the other topic I really liked was uh, different ways you can build homes, mm -hmm. like you know instead of the conventional way of um, drywall and wood and insulation and stuff like that, the alternatives to that. I thought that was really cool. Great. And um, were there enough hands-on things for you to do? Did oh, you plenty. get to like get in there and do things? or? Yes, and I think those were some of my son's more favorite classes <laughs> uh, was the hands-on stuff because, well, he's 16. He enjoyed the class, but he really likes the hands-on. <laughs> he enjoyed making the soap. Mm -hmm. I missed that class, unfortunately. <laughs> <laughs> we definitely try to meet the needs of different learning styles, so we try to have things that are visual um, and things for auditory learners and, and you know physical things. It's a mix of all, so that's great. And uh, anything you'd like to say to anyone who's thinking about taking the course? Um, it come with a lot of questions. And, you know, don't be afraid to ask them because you'll get really good answers and um, come to prepared to actually work on a living farm. Cool. I think it's really neat. Oh, I love the seed when we did the seeds and learning about the plant, about the plants and um, when to grow them and all that. I thought that was really good. How to start seed. Yeah. And um, um, I thought that was really good because I've, I've had gardens before and, you know, it's always been a iffy thing, well, maybe I should plant this, and like watermelon, did not know that watermelon didn't grow in this area. I thought it was just us not being very good at it. <laughs> so, there you go. Great. Well, thank you. You're welcome. And if you want more information about the uh, apprenticeship programs for the Self-Sufficiency Skills course, go to www.songcroft.com. Bye for now. <laughs>